hello friends in this video we are going to talk about uh, google finance and google charts so many people doesn't know how to use google charts uh, how to find the historical data how to analyze the things all these things i'm going to cover here it will be very useful for you guys uh, if you are already uh, having experience uh, in trading uh, for you it is very benefit and also people uh, who wanted to learn about stock market stock market uh, trends analysis for them also i am covering here uh, you can watch complete video so you will get complete understanding in google finance it will be very useful for you guys and also please subscribe my channel uh, for all technical videos so i'm going to create a lot of technical videos um, for you all today we are going to uh, discuss how to add uh, remove stocks in google finance and how to understand charts how to set technical indicators this is a very important concept you need to learn and you need to write it down in some book okay so it will be very useful for you guys whenever you see some other videos uh, or technical videos like uh, uh, simple moving average rsi method macd all these things uh, you can see here uh, the technical indicators how we can set how to compare shares performance okay this is also very important oh, and how to use a line candlestick and uh, OHLC charts how to create your portfolio with uh, Google and how to add add shares to your portfolio and how to import or export your portfolio and these all things are very important uh, as a trader or intraday trader as an investor you should know all these things uh, then only you can track uh, your shares performance and also the effective uh, investment you can do it in profitable way i am going to start with uh, google finance okay uh, if you have any doubts any questions if you are not able to understand if you are not able to follow this video please uh, get back to me and uh, you can mail me at ramanjil.techhelp.gmail.com uh, i am going to or reply as soon as possible uh, once i receive email okay you can uh, understand very easily open your browser and uh, type here google finance so you will get this link uh, just open it and my suggestion is uh, please uh, login your uh, gmail account okay so uh, you can whatever the settings you do here uh, it will be saved by default and also the portfolio everything you can track it okay now we are going to see how to add the stock into this google charts uh, uh, let's take uh, sbin sbin state bank of india this is very simple just we have to click and add ok now i have added uh, that stock into my google charts let's uh, drag down and see i will remove all the settings ok so i am going to explain everything again see here uh, this is the chart ok this is the chart uh, here we have like one day five days one month three months six months uh, year to date okay here some people will get confusion this is a year to date okay uh, starting year to current date and this is a year to year from last year the same date to current year uh, same date so this is for five years and ten years and all the all the data from when the stock is uh, uh, started trading uh, this will take one day and we'll see the price fluctuations uh, down we have volumes everything we can see here 
uh, if you come down here we have like a settings and also we have here uh, technicals this is very important thing uh, where you need to concentrate and where you need to learn the things and now i will show you how to set the technical aspects here if you click on settings uh, here you can see here and the line charts that we are using currently line chart this is the line chart okay if you click on candles okay you will get candles here you can see here the candles okay this is completely free so anyone can use this one and also OHLC see here and all the buyings uh, in green color and sellings in uh, red color uh, this is very useful guys we will go ahead and select a line only and uh, let's go and see technical here we have to click on add technical uh, you can see here uh, already have created uh, so many videos for uh, uh, simple moving average method and uh, uh, EMEA method, exponential moving average method and MACD and RSI method uh, uh, we have a lot of videos in my channel you can watch them and uh, RSI method also I have given one video and that also you can watch it will be very useful if you are a beginner uh, please do paper trading before applying these all techniques uh, before investing your money my sincere advice to you guys please do paper trading before applying any technique so you will get understanding some people they uh, whenever uh, the signal comes uh, they will enter immediately it should not like that uh, we should not enter in every signal when we set technical indicators uh, there are chances to give or wrong technical things also so you must have to observe one or two days okay, if you are experienced guy uh, if you are a fresher uh, my suggestion is uh, please uh, do paper trading at least 10 trading days so you will get a better idea see if you wanted to add a simple moving average method see here uh, you can add it and uh, we can add one more here again EMA method you can add it here only anyone only we can choose this one if you want to remove technical you can remove and uh, also we have a lot of things value moving average method see here we got one more uh, uh, MACD you can see here MACD we got one more like these kind of things um, you can you see my videos other videos uh, what we need to set uh, this simple average uh, simple moving average method the period what we need to give and uh, moving average method what is the period we need to select um, and also EMA and RSI everything I have given uh, in other videos but this is just a brief introduction how we can utilize these charts and graphs um, so people won't get confusion and uh, since this is the open platform we can use it uh, very nicely and if you compare share prices uh, to the trading platform and uh, these Google charts, we will get live trading uh, updates. Uh, what are the share price is trading in a trading platform? Same share price we can see here. Uh, there is no more gap uh, between stock market and uh, Google charts. That is a wonderful thing. What we can tell. now we are going to see how to compare uh, two shares okay how to compare two shares or uh, uh, indicators okay this is a very very important thing uh, where uh, you need to compare few things with the stock how the stock is going uh, as compared to the indicators okay uh, we will look into the nifty indicator here you if you wanted to compare it you are here uh, you need to type nft nifty uh, here we have nifty 50 just uh, click on add you can see here 
you sell one month if you select one month uh, you can compare it see here uh, the nifty and sbi sbi is a 2.12 percent is a positive and uh, nifty is a 0.75 percent uh, negative the overall uh, uh, one month and the same way we will go ahead and uh, do some other stocks we will take here uh, infosys nowadays infosys is uh, not doing well okay we will see how the nifty and the uh, infosys is performing you can see here a uh, six month chart if you see six month charts here uh, the NP is the nifty is 15 percent up the same way you can see here uh, infosys is a uh, 14.56% around 15% is down you can see the downtrend here downtrend completely downtrend uh, the infosys you can you can observe these colors also this is the blue color uh, you can see down and the red color uh, you can see uh, upper uh, this this is a very useful uh, thing where we need to compare the shares and with indicator okay the see whenever you see a good share a good stock okay if it is a performing well uh, we can see it moves along with the indicator okay whenever indicator jumps even the stock price also will jumps when the company is not performing well that time only it will go down that you have to keep in your mind and we will see how to create the portfolio before creating this portfolio you must have to log in your uh, gmail account uh, in google uh, finance so it will be saved just click here we will give our my portfolio just an example you can give any name just click on ok here uh, just we will add sbin uh, we have added uh, sb into your portfolio just click on uh, edit transactions we here buy symbol the date number of shares 100 the price amount 255 commission 100 rupees will pay Save changes for you. We can track all our portfolio here. If you see over you, you can see here the chain price. Everything you can see here. And if you click on performance, so you can see the performance of the stock. Okay, if you wanted to. wanted to import transactions you can import edit transactions you can do it you can delete portfolio download spreadsheet also you can download the spreadsheet okay you can download and you can do it in excel this is a very useful website okay every day you can compare it so it will be very useful for you uh, to understand and to track every action I hope we have done uh, with our session. Uh, thank you all for watching this video. Uh, please subscribe my channel so you will get a lot of technical videos, uh, technical terminologies, all the indexes, how to play with uh, Nifty and Bank Nifty, other stocks, uh, different different technical methods, how it will work, how to set the graphs where you need to give parameters everything i'm going to give uh, in a step by step manner if you are a learner it will be very useful if you are already a trader uh, still it will be very useful for you guys uh, if you need any help uh, in terms of technical you can mail me at ramanjul.techhelp.gmail.com here it is okay thank you all